So good evening, everybody. This is your stay-at-home grandma, and it's Tuesday's tips. Okay, and we're going to make brown sugar. Yes, brown sugar. The kind of brown sugar that you buy in the store that many of us probably didn't know where it came from, but I do. Okay, so just to be on the safe side, we're going to get a cup of sugar, pour it into our blender. How's everybody doing? I'm doing fine. Into our blender. Okay. Now, the ingredients is, and has always been, and should always be, molasses. Yeah, I have grandma's molasses. Gold standard since 1890. Original. I put this in a half a teaspoon, well actually a tablespoon full, but we're going to try it with half a, half a teaspoon first because there's a difference with the consistency. If you want light brown sugar, you use a half. If you want dark brown sugar, you use a, a tablespoon. I'm going to pour it in. Always grease, put a little bit of oil in your, in your, um, Measurement cup when it comes to honey and things like that because it'll pour off so much easier. Just a trick that I learned from somebody I don't know. I think bigger, bolder. I'm not sure. Now, that as you can see is in there, right there. And so we're going to put this on, lock it, put the top on, and you'll hear it. Give it a stir for the snot. It's not picking up yet, but it will. Yeah, that was good. Let me get this a stir. Oh, we'll see. Okay, so. Let's go on it. Oh, the floor, so I'm going to have to wash off. Be right back. I can't deal with things falling on the floor, though. Even though the floor was just washed today. But anyway. Can we put... Oh, come on. Well, I'll find it later. Sorry about that. a little bit more in. Get a spoon and stir it around. Mm. Powder from the sugar.
little bit more in. A little bit more in. Okay. Thanks for bearing with me. Sorry about that. But you know that there's always some kind of difficulties. So now the smoke has cleared, so it's big. Okay. And this is, this is the lighter brown one. So can you see that? It's a lighter brown one. Now if you want it to be darker brown, Okay, then you mix in a little bit more. And some of the, I'm going to mix it just a little bit more because some of the molasses, because molasses sticks. Like honey. So you're going to scrape it off the sides. Put it down by the blender. And then. Put it on again. Now,
Uh, if I had my Vitamix, it would actually mix much quicker. But I like this little blender because I can take it all around and, and then I can carry it around with me. That's why I like this little blender. And they have your brown consistency in there. And it still needs to be blended just a little bit more. But that's it. And it's brown. And you have your brown sugar. And you can make your cookies or whatever. So you don't have to always, I mean, you know, it's always good to have an extra brown, brown sugar or whatever. But that's what you try not to do. You try to actually... I don't know. You try to actually do it so that you don't have to go out and buy things because back in the day, before they had all the stores and everything like that, they knew how to make it. So I hope you like this video. If you like, share, and subscribe, leave a comment in the comment section, give it a thumbs up, and I will start putting, I'm putting it together my recipe book and stuff, and it'll be sold on Amazon, and it'll be, um, I guess, Kindle, so you know what I mean, you can download it and whatever. I think it'll be like two dollars or something like that. I'm not sure yet. But anyway, like, share, and subscribe. Leave a comment in the comment section. Give it a thumbs up. I love you. Take care. God bless. Bye bye.